first of all, I want to say, oh, praises be to Yahweh Pashem, Yahweh Shai Pashem, and I'm going to say double honors to the apostles and elders, the great most on, and Shalom to sincere elect teaching his truth and faith and sincerity. Quick uh, topic I want to speak on. It's based here on the scripture here, man, in um, Isaiah 9 and 5. But, 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 but the, the, the main inspiration is an article over here that I saw a couple of days ago. This is ex Russian uh, president warns of NATO <laughs> apocalypse. Which, if you go further in, in this article, which, which, which you know, which which basically if you go further in, in, into this article he it basically says it's going to get t t to a point where uh, russia will have will, will have no fault um uh will basically have no choice but but to, to you know sh shoot off the uh, nuclear missiles but which makes me think about um the book of you know ezekiel 38 you know, when it speaks about them at some point, the uh, Gog Magog thinking, yeah, you know I mean, <laughs> so, sorry, um, thinking and evil thought, man, <laughs> to base, you know, which is basically going up against that that uh, nation with what unwalled villages and dwelling without care and in pride. Which you know is Babylon and also the state you know I've been in Israel, but basically he basically says he basically he says it he says it that it's gonna get to a stage where they're gonna have no choice but to shoot off these missiles. So people you know this is in our, our daily lives, man, and we we'll see these uh, <laughs> tensions escalate between. Russia, America, Iran, and China, and all these nations, man. So anyone, you know, you, you, you have people out there saying, "Yeah, uh, this war is gonna happen in fifty years. It's, it's not gonna happen in my lifetime." That's bullshit. It, it's happening now, and it's gonna happen. <laughs> hey, here it is. People are partying and bullshit, but it's actual conversation on basically. It's gonna get to the stage. The missile's gonna get shot. Anyway, it says um, I'll, I'll, I'll just I'll touch on some key points and bring out some scriptures. Uh, it says a full scale between Russia and NATO would leave Moscow with with no choice but to deploy its nuclear access. Former um, President D D Dmitry Medvedev said. He reiterated, however, that his country is not seeking a conflict with a, a, the U.S.-led military bloc, you know, which is a lie, you know, like the, the reason why they are preparing for war is because they're preparing for war. It's going to be used, right? But it's spiritual because the scripture says in Revelation chapter 17 that 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 this war and conflict is going to get to a stage that these nations that are in league with with Babylon, whether it be Germany, whether it be France or even England, that these nations that are in league with Babylon, which is America, that they are also gonna turn on Babylon and strike them also with nuclear missiles. The scripture refers to that in Revelation seventeenth chapter. But you know that 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 war and conflict will, will, will first you know start off, and then people are gonna change sides, man, and switch sides, man. We, we actually have have already seen that already by the history in World War One and World War Two. There was nations that started on on one side of the war, and by the end of the wars, they they, 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 they ended up on a different side. And and that's what's gonna happen in this war. But in this war, 
all nations that have nuclear c- capability, even those that are in league w- with America, are gonna t- t- turn on America and burn her with fire. Right, but anyway, it says, um, it says, writing on t- 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 Telegram on Wednesday, Medvedev, who now serves as a deputy chairman of Russia's six. Security Council pushed back against statements by numerous Western leaders urging their countries to prepare for a potential conflict with Moscow, right? Which, you know, makes me think of, you know, um, Joel chapter 3. But right before I go there, I'm going to read this. This is um, Isaiah 9 and 5. For every battle is with, is with confused noise and garments rolled in blood. So, so as we see with, you know, in these films, right, whether it be 300 or even in Troy, all these ancient conflict, conflicts were fought a certain way. <clears throat> that is going to be different to now. But this shall be with burning and fuel of fire because this this war, as they say, is going to be the war to end the wars. You know, you know, you know, you know what people always say as a, a, a famous quote. All right, if 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 there's a World War Four, which they which they ain't going to be, it's 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 it's, it's going to be fought with uh, uh, sticks and stones, right? Because basically, so much. Destruction is going to take place. But this war is going to be with burning and fuel of fire. Which is what? Nuclear uh, missiles. That There has never been a time where multiple nations of the planet have nuclear capability to bring mass destruction upon each other right now you know people can say oh you you had a pearl harbor and <laughs> you know the the eventual strike over hiroshima and and like zaki with you know you know the them uh you know i mean uh them atomic bobs but mm, see, 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 see the thing is mm, nuclear warfare is a whole different ball game right so that ain't when you're talking about uh, deaths of just uh, you know a couple hundred people or a thousand people no that's 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 what you're talking about, the tens, you know what I mean, the hundreds of of millions, right? Well, I mean, the Babylon the Great, which is America, their population is around three hundred and fifty million plus people, man. So come on, man, just 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 imagine which it, which it, which it is gonna take place, Babylon the the the, the great. Uh, being new that's hundreds of millions of people dying in an instant right but anyway it says but this shall be with burden and fuel of fire alright fuel something eaten by by fire that's just gonna happen uh, people's flesh alright this is uh Revelation chapter chapter eleven and fourteen. All right, it says the second war is past, and and and, and behold, the third war uh, 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 quickly. Uh, you know, the scripture speaks about the three woes. Woe, woe, woe! It pertains to the three world wars: World War One, World War Two, and what's about to take place world war three you see you know 
and that's what's going to take place. That's what scripture speaks about it. Of, of, uh, this, is, uh, this is the book of, 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 of Second Ezra, right? 16 and 13. For, for strong is his right hand that beareth the bow. His arrows that he shooteth are sharp and sh shall not miss. When they begin to be shot into the ends of the world. Now, now what is that talking about? All right, those arrows that are going to be shot into the ends of the world is clearly talking about the ICBMs, the Intercontinental Ballistic uh, 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 Missiles. Right, this 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 capability has never existed upon the earth until now now right from russia to, to you know i mean america can, can be met within the space of 15 uh, minutes but with with these nuclear missiles man straight up and that's never existed before but guess what it's 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 it's, it's, it's existed now because it's going to take place now or in that time, behold, the plagues are sent and shall not return again until they be, until they come upon the earth. Which the, the, you know that major plague spoken of in, in, in Zechariah fourteen, their eyes consuming consumed uh, up in their holes and their tongues consuming up in their mouth, right? As uh, as a seed in uh, that uh, a seed man uh, up in Independence Day, no no it's Terminator. You see, judgment, man. All right. Anyway, let's go back into the article and just hit, just hit, 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 hit major points. Um, <coughs> it says, ha um, ha ha. However. Medford then, right, warned that a possible Moscow NATO war would be drastically uh, uh, different to the U U U U U Ukraine uh, uh, conflict and would not rely on the use of artillery, tanks, or drones. He noted that the uh, 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 alliance has a combined population of one uh, billion people and defense spending reaching 1.5 trillion and making it so far superior to, to, to Russia so which is what they're saying well we know in prophecy that you know, Russia, Iran, uh, Turkey, and, and, and many nations in league with Russia, as is mentioned in Ezekiel 38, shall shall be on 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 their side against Babylon. But then, if it goes on to say in Revelation 17 that these nations that's in league with the Gog Magog is going to basically, you know. Uh, 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 be in league with them to 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 destroy Babylon, man. <laughs> it says, um, since our military capabilities are incomparable, which 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 again, he just lied. Because there's been so much information on, like, remember where the the, the, the Satan two, um. Uh, 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 a missile got brought out that bro the, the, the United States chiefs basically I had to come out and admit that if this 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 ICBM this this missile gets shot it, it can't be stopped man <laughs> it's crazy it says it says since our military com com um, capabilities are incomparable we will simply have no choice Right, the response will be 
Et c'est bon, tu peux. Um, to protect the territorial integrity of our country. Ballistic and cruise missiles with special warheads will be used. So, so, so that's what they're saying, man. That's gonna get straight up get get used. Here it is for a very long time. Uh, people have been saying, "Oh, it ain't gonna be in my lifetime." No, 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 no. He's just saying these ICBMs with special warheads are going to be used, and when it and when it and when it, and when it, it, it is used, oh, what's going to take place? The destruction of Babylon the Great, which is America. But I'm gonna get a quick uh, a few scriptures on that. Right? This is um, Isaiah. 13 and, uh, and, and, and 4 to 5 the noise of a multitude in the mountains like as of a great people a tumultuous noise of the kingdoms of the nations gathered to to uh, gather the, the lord of hosts uh, master of the host of the battle they come from a far country from the end of heaven, even though the Lord and the weapons of his, of his indignation to destroy the whole land. And this is talking about the ICBMs, right? The nuclear missiles, man. Which the major main nation, right? You know, that's the, that's, that's the, that, that will play a part. It, it, in the means, sure, is the means, man. Gog Mega Russia What it says to destroy the whole land. The whole land that's gonna be destroyed is America, man. Babylon the Great. Right? And it and it even goes on to say in verse 17, behold, I will stir up the, the, the means against them, which shall not regard silver, and as for the gold, they shall not delight in it, because the times go come where no peace, uh, 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 a treaty or, or whatever will be able to to get me to 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 stop this this judgment, man. It, it's it's it, it, it'll get past the stage where you know no more talking of peace treaties can be taken. You know, <laughs> scripture speaks about that evil thought, man. In Ezekiel thirty eight, their bows, right? Remember this: the the the, the bows. You know, I mean, it shall be shot into the ends of the world. Second Ezra. Their bows also shall dash the young men to pieces, and they shall have no pity on the fruit of the womb. Their eyes shall not spare children, because when the ICBMs are shot, the, the ICBMs, the, 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 that's, that's going to destroy the whole land. They ain't going to stop for uh, men, women, you know, or, or children or women. No, they're just going to just do their thing, man. And Babylon. The glory of the beauty of the Chaldees' excellency shall be as when the Most High overthrew Sodom and Gomorrah. It shall never be inhabited, neither shall it be dwelt from generation to generation. Neither shall the Arabian pitch tent there, neither shall the shepherds make their fold there. But wild beasts of the desert shall lie there, and their houses shall be full of doleful creatures, and owls shall dwell there, and satire shall dance there, and the beasts of the of, of, wild islands shall cry in their desolate houses, and the uh, uh, dragons in their pleasant palaces. This ties directly into to Revelation 18. Because after the destruction of Babylon, you know, you know which is America, the only thing that's going to like inhabit that land or uh, 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 desert like creatures that could 
live in that kind of climate. And what wild beasts of the island shall cry there in their, in their desolate houses and the 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 uh, dragons in their desolate in their uh, sorry in their peasant uh, palaces. And her time is near, and her days shall not be for, for long. And that her is that whore, and that whore is America, right? See, yo, but, but, but that's what's gonna, gonna uh, take place, man. <laughs> you know, I mean, you know. So hey, from from Russia with love but guess what as it says in the book of Jeremiah 50 right they're gonna be just around Russia right the scripture says O ye back bed 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 the bow so all these nations were there oh man sorry It says uh Jeremiah uh, fifty and fourteen. Even if further up it says you know speaks about the great uh, Britain coming against Babylon the Great. It says sorry, um Jeremiah fifty and fourteen Put yourselves in array against Babylon round about all ye that men the bow shoot at her spare no arrows let me start from 13 because of the, 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 the wrath of the lord it shall not be inhabited but it shall be holy uh, uh, excellent and at any time the scripture speaks about a land being totally destroyed and never being brought back up, it applies to Babylon the Great, man. Everyone that goeth by Babylon shall be as astonished and hiss at all of her plagues because, you know, through the, the uh, satellites, man. People gonna be seen on their screens. Yo, man, it's a lake. It's just all on fire. And then they're gonna, you know, just just just, uh, just before that takes place, you know, they're gonna be seen uh, her brothers, sisters, and children getting beamed up into them them chariots, man, to them UFOs. It's gonna be a crazy time, and then they're gonna try and fight. You know what I mean? Our Lord and lose. Put yourselves in array against Babylon round about. All you that bend the ball, shoot at her and spare no uh, uh, arrows, for, for she has sinned against the the Lord. <laughs> right? And, 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 and that's what's going to take place. I keep mentioning it, but I, 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 I might actually read that point. Right? And close out, you know. Um. Uh, you know, all these nations need to leave with Babylon and are gonna uh, t turn against them, right? Uh, Revelation 17 and 15 on down, and he said unto me, Though the, the, the waters which thou sawest where, where the whole city of our peoples and multitude of nations and tongues, and that's you know, that whole it, it is America, man. They have major power and, and influence upon the earth and the ten hordes which are source upon, upon upon the beast which ties into the eu right these shall hate the whore and shall make her desolate and naked and shall eat her flesh and burn her with fire so even they're going to turn against babylon but remember the scripture says all ye that bend the, the ball shoot at her spend no arrow so at some point the, the logo put it in, in these nations' minds just turned against America, man. You know, because again, in, in World War One and Two, we, 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 you know, we've actually seen that happen, where like a, a nation starts on one side of the war, and by the end of the war, they've chopped and changed sides, man. I mean, I believe it was 
Italy, man. They they chopped and changed sides. But in this war, all, all these nations, even ones that, you know, the scripture speaks about in Jeremiah 50 and 12, your mother being so confounded, even nations that you, you, you would think would back Babylon onto the end, they are going to turn against Babylon. And the state of Israel is also going to be, you know, burnt up in you know, World War Three, But it's going to be re rebuilt back up. But the nation that's never going to be built up again, <clears throat> that's Babylon the Great, which is America. It says, These shall hate the whore, and shall make her desolate and naked, and shall eat her flesh and burn her with fire. For the most I have put it in their hearts to fulfill, fulfill his will, and to agree, and to be given, and... Give their kingdom unto the beast until the words of the Lord shall be fulfilled. So where, so where, so where, 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 where are these days, man? These these prophecies, these things happen before our eyes. That's why we have to keep pushing this word and staying fervent. So with that, we say praises be unto you. How about you? I shine, but you work out with us. Number one, to the positive, that was a great most. Until next time, I will say, shalom.